Here's an operation that most Chevy Volt owners seldom see and that's called engine maintenance mode. Even less frequently is the gas maintenance mode but both the first generation which I have and the second generation both have an engine maintenance mode. I did a video a few years ago on the other one when it did it the first time and the only time it's ever done it. The new one has now done it. Let's uh, take a look at the differences between the two. People have asked me about my Chevy Volt and uh, how do you prevent the gas from going stale especially when you drive in electric mode uh, most of the time like I do. Things like how, what stops the gas from going stale? What about your engine sitting idle without being used for months on end? Well the solution to that is uh, the Chevy engineers very cleverly have built in a program into the operating system of the car to prevent the gas from going stale. It will force you to use up the gas if it's been sitting in the tank for a year but there's also another mode called maintenance mode and what maintenance mode does is if the vehicle has not started the engine for a period of six weeks it will force you to run the engine for 10 minutes and what this does is it lubricates the moving parts and it performs maintenance on the mission control system my volt here the engine has not started for six weeks today I got a message telling me that my engine needs to run in maintenance mode Okay, got the car going. We're going to start it up now. We'll get the uh, engine maintenance. As you can see, I have driven 1,863.7 kilometers, zero liters. Got 1,158 miles, no gas usage. So now I've switched into maintenance mode. It says engine maintenance. Here we go. It's gonna run it here for a few minutes. And this lubricates the engine and does all the uh, mission control components. Seems like it's gonna run pretty quick here too. It's at 17% already. This is uh, the first time I've seen this come up. You probably notice there's not much gas in the car. That's because when I got back from my road trip in the summer, I reset the uh, trip counter, but I haven't put any gas in this thing in, in, you know, at least six weeks. So I normally don't keep a lot of gas in the vehicle. I only keep a little bit in just for emergency use. That way I don't have to burn up more if it goes stale. So I usually only keep about a quarter of a tank unless I'm actually doing road trips. But this engine maintenance is proceeding uh, pretty quick faster than the second generation which we'll show in a second at this rate that's not going to be no 10 minutes it's uh, been only about a one minute we're already at 50 percent and there we go that was engine maintenance mode and that'll happen again in another six weeks if I don't burn any gas. Of course, I've gotten my perfect zero, 0, 0 0.0 liters. That's gone, but uh, that's it. Engine maintenance mode is completed on my Volt. So the last time I got in my car, I got a message telling me that the engine needed to go into maintenance mode. Oh, here we go. We'll do that. So this will put it into what they call maintenance mode. I guess that means the engine has to run because it hasn't run in 6,069 kilometers. That's the last time that uh, the engine ran on this car. That will be back in uh, September. So it's been uh, four months the engine hasn't run. So I guess it's going to run this time for a couple minutes. There we go, engine complete, engine maintenance mode. Just start it up. See how long it runs for. Shouldn't run for that long. It should only run for maybe even a minute or two. But this is something that happens very, very infrequently on these uh, cars. If I look on the other dashboard here. Just showing the engine is running.
and uh, it'll run for maybe a minute or so just to warm up this is just to lubricate components in the engine and uh, circulate the oil so this happens well if the engine doesn't run for four months and then it'll also if the gas sits in the tank for a year it'll force you to burn it up so it's at 40 percent uh, 41 percent complete now when this message comes up you can defer it a couple times and but then it once so if you're only going on a short trip you can defer it but you can only do that for 24 hours and then after that 24 hour period is up the next time you start the car it's going to go into that mode so that's to give you a heads up that it's going to need to run it doesn't run for very long it only it's going to run for a minute or so how long has it been going now for you know a minute minute 45 so it doesn't run that long Sixty percent now, sixty-one percent. I remember this happened once. I only did it once on the other car a few years ago when I was doing all kinds of short trips, and the engine never came on. I think I got uh, one time on the other car. I did ten thousand kilometers on a tank of gas. I should be able to do that with this one as well. I'm at. Uh, 6,000 plus now and I've still got a quarter of a tank so I should hit 10,000 kilometers I would think on this car before I have to fill the tank one thing I noticed on this one is while I'm driving the engine cycling off and on and when the engine turns off the maintenance cage stops so you actually have to drive it um, I don't know what it would do if I would just if I was just sitting there because when I was the other car when I hit the uh, the start maintenance mode the engine started immediately and it ran through the maintenance mode without me even having, actually having to drive the car. This one, it didn't. It actually waited until I was moving and then it went into maintenance mode. And as the engine shuts off because I'm going down a hill now. That's probably why the uh, engine maintenance is stuck at 74% because the engine's actually shut off. Okay, the engine's come back on now, so I guess the, uh, the maintenance mode will continue. But it did go off there when I was going down a hill there for a bit. This time it took about 10 minutes. I was on the freeway here and it took about 10 minutes this time for the maintenance mode. So I guess I'll see this probably in another four months or so. Just in time for me to go on my road trips when I actually start burning some gas in the car. Almost done, I would think. Got 99% complete. There we go. Now it's completed, and it should be switching back to. There we go. Now we're back to. Uh, now we're back to gas or electric mode again. Thanks for watching. We'll catch you in another one real soon.